guys welcome back to my channel i know it's been forever but i'm back now um today we're making a super cute first birthday cake for a baby boy it's gonna be a sprinkles cake with a little fondant teddy bear on top it's gonna be so cute so let's get right into it so first things first, we have to assemble our cake. So I've got some vanilla cake here. It's 10 inch rounds that I have leveled off and sliced each layer in half. And then I have mango Italian meringue buttercream, which is so good, and vanilla Italian meringue buttercream. And that's just gonna go around the outside so we get that nice white finish. So I'm gonna get stacking. So now that we're done with the mango, we're going to do a crumb coat with our vanilla buttercream. And so that's just a really, really thin layer of frosting on the outside to seal all the crumbs in. So I finished the crumb coat. Um, I'm just going to pop it in the fridge for about 20 minutes or so. And then we're going to put another nice thick layer of icing on. So I will be back. Okay, so now it's time for the second layer of icing which we're gonna make nice and thick, and that's what the sprinkles are gonna sit on. So, let's do that. I'm just gonna smooth out all the edges using this straight edge um, thing. <laughs> Use like a bench scraper or something. But, it's really gonna give me a nice smooth finish. I think we are good to go. I'm just gonna take my cake and throw it in the fridge. We're gonna let it set up a little bit before we put on the sprinkles, so be right back. My cake is taking way too long to chill, so I'm gonna eat the leftover mango icing till they're ready. Don't tell anyone. That's good. Sprinkles time. I love sprinkles. Sprinkles are so fun. Um, I've got blue and white and we're going to mix them together like 50-50 and then we're going to cover the cake with them. So my cake has been chilled and it is ready for the sprinkles. So I've got my sprinkles mixed together. I've got a tray underneath my cake to catch the sprinkles. And we are just going to start patting them on, just like so. So we're gonna work on the decorations on top and I'm gonna put this in the fridge for now. So now it's time for decorations. I've got this little teddy bear. He's made of fondant. He is so cute. I'm obsessed with him. His name is Moxie. Don't ask me why, it just is. Um, and I've got this number one here. It's made of fondant as well. So I made these a couple days ago and let them dry. I will insert footage right now of me making them so you guys can see how to do it. And now we are going to make a little 
piece of fondant to sit on top of the cake where we can write happy birthday on it. So let's roll some fondant. I've got this fluted tart pan and I'm just gonna use it as like a cookie cutter. I don't know if you can see the texture on there, but it's super pretty. I'm picking the front and then I'm gonna do a little bit of buttercream. Taking my little blanket and draping that. I'm just gonna secure the sides with some buttercream. Super cute, super cute. And we're gonna take Moxie. I'm thinking we go like that. And then we go like that. And a little buttercream on his tushy. So freaking cute. So cute. So I'm just gonna pipe a border around the base of the cake. I've got a number 10 tip on my piping bag. I'm gonna start at the back and then work my way all the way around. Okay guys, here is the final product. I think it turned out super cute. The teddy bear is definitely my favorite. He's so cute. I don't want to give him away. But anyways, I hope you guys liked this video. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up. Leave me a comment down below letting me know what you thought or if you have any questions. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you're not already and follow my Instagram at Desserts by Arisa. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.